Alex, so we're here at Wings Over Wairapa 2013. We've got uh, four carriers here, which people would generally know as Bren gun carriers, but one of them is a, is a Lloyd carrier. There's four here this weekend. You're hoping to get a lot more for the next show, is that right? Yeah, what we're trying to do is we're trying to break the world record of the most amount of um, carriers in one place at one time. And I think we have to travel around two miles to break that record. And I think the number is about 17. So we're trying to top that. So how many do you think you'll be able to get? Um, we're aiming for possibly over 20 to try and beat the Australians. So why are there so many in New Zealand? Um, well, New Zealand, we built, of course, we built quite a lot of them. And um, we didn't really have a lot of um, vehicles at the start of the war. So we're buying them in furiously to try and mobilise our troops. So we ended up with um, quite a lot of stuff from England and um, just because Kiwis are Kiwis, they got kept going for years and years and um, then put out to pasture and farming and that sort of thing. Now the, the record you're trying to break, is that purely a, a record based on, on the numbers of carriers or is there something involved with the number of different variants that we might get here as well? Well it's based purely on, on numbers and the distance that they travel um, but what we're trying to achieve and what I think we can do quite easily is just the, the expensive range of carriers that we have in New Zealand and what's in New Zealand is, is second to none. Europe can't achieve the range that we can, even Australia can't. Um, you know, we have nearly every type of carrier apart from, I think, two. Um, so we need to maybe look at importing those two and we'd have nearly every type of carrier produced. Right, so is that a, a historical thing or, or has it just been in more recent decades that the, some of the other different variants have been imported? Um, a lot of them have been here since sort of the end of the war. Um, and onwards, um, but it's basically ex-war stock that was here and um, what we built. Um, a few have come in just recently, but um, not a lot because of the what's already in New Zealand, and they were sort of reasonably easy to find in earlier years, but they're getting a bit scarce now. Yeah. All right. Oh, good luck with breaking that record, and we'll be back in a couple of years to see how you get on. Thanks, Alex. Thanks